down here. Things so around easy on you. But don't get on my bad side. Get me mad, and I'll prank you. And not a little, a lot. You're that... I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Oh, the thing is, we don't actually have an attic room. But I think I know what you mean. Go ahead and make yourself at home. We got room. And food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. So you're the Dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Follow me. Now we can talk. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. <coughs> it was the only way I could make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were dragged. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeards sent, and not some Thalmor. We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Good and you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life. And I... I know... And I figured... We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed... Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. 
I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynesgrove. Wait, how? <laughs> hey! We got some firs Your and choice. tree branches, paint them white, and then tie them to stone. Instant Lord, it's eyes. Nice. 
Look at that big bastard. Keep your head down. Let's see what it... Dragonborn. I owe you some answers, don't I? Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. I'm one of the last members of the... A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Exactly. Nobody even remembers our name these days. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone, though. For the last 200 years, we've been searching for the next Dragonborn to guide and guard, as we are sworn to do. But we never found one, until now. 
The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years back. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? Before the Great War, the Blades helped the Empire against the Thalmor. Our Grand Master saw them as the greatest threat to Tamriel. At the time, that was true. Maybe it still is. So we fought them in the shadows, all across Tamriel. We thought we were more than a match for them. We were wrong. If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. retrieved the horn of Jorgen Wimkall. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. First, Master Wolfgar will teach you the final word of unrelenting force. You are ready. speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards, but you are ready. Sure. Oh. Ah, now, so like the 
что отмораживают. Эй, жду и смир! Кто ваш брод? Талман! Талрок! Дувакин, you have tasted the voice of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. Heard they're reforming the Dawn God. Vampire hunters or something. I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. Once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to Whiterun from Old Rorikstead. The sooner you find the claw, the sooner I... Don't let my sister... You found it! <laughs> there it is! Strange. It seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. It means so much to Thank us to have the claw. I think belongs. I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. 
I cook. Ain't much else to tell. We drink to our youth today. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor the Embassy. Age of aggression is just about done. That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to attract the wrong kind of attention. The but they don't know you at all yet. With our blood and our the steel, Thalm we will I can get you into one of I have a his name. I'll get word for him to meet you. While you're doing that, Down I'll work on... With Meet me at the Solitude the Stables after you've kings. arranged things with Melbourne. Any death, questions? We will drink and we'll sing. We're the children of Skyrim and we fight all our lives. And when Southern Guard beckons, every one of us dies. But this land is... A New in town, right? If you need a place to sleep, head over to the Weeping Skeever. Fletching suits me. It's difficult and sometimes tedious, but a well-made arrow strikes yes. forth like the fury of a god. Nord. Really? Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. You're asking me? If you actually want to get out alive, I'll, I'll give you a few more minutes. I can't wait here all day. It's my neck on the line, remember? You ready yet? I need to get back before I missed. Remember, you won't have anything except what I smuggle in for you. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got a... Being old's not so bad. Daughter keeps me fed. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll t What could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? You got business at the stables? Is this about the stables? My husband Gaiman handles the business. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Good. I have your... But the only way... Which means you need to look... When you're ready. I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Malborn smuggled in for you, plus whatever you... pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor M. See, dressed like... 
that. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. Welcome to the Thalmor Embassy. Your invitation, please. I prefer to arrive early. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Here's my invitation. I don't have a poison dagger. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Elenwyn, the Thalmor Ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, Madam tell me more about I'm yourself. So what you brings you to this... <laughs> to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? By the way, have you heard any it's any just that we've way. run out of the Alto wine. Well, I did see Do something I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. Red. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Seems they've been traveling yes, around Madam the whole Skyrim, peddling their words. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. war going on. What can I get for you? What can I get for you, sir? Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. What does a fellow need to What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? My friend, you are very perceptive. I have a powerful thirst that cannot be slaked. And none of the waiters will bring me a drink. Ellen Wen must have told him to cut me off, the frigid bitch. Afraid I'll cause another scene, I suppose. You must be new around here. Bad manners. But I have nothing to hide. I'm in from the south. And if you want to do business in Tamriel these days, well, you'd better get used to cozying up to the Thalmor. Like it or not. What can I get for you, sir? Here you go, sir. The finest Colovian brandy. Is there anything else I can get for you? Mm. I need another drink. What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles! If there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Wonderful! I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. Is that all? <laughs> My friend, you've come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. Stand back and behold my handiwork. Attention, everyone! Yes, what do you need? I have your All right, then. Please. Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the... Let's go. Let's go. Before anyone notices us. Our yes, mistress. What are you I speak doing? figuratively, of course. Uh. Nothing could be more unlikely than that someone would actually want her in their bed. Although, so far so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. Again, we need to pass I through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking, got it? Follow me.
Who comes, Malburn? You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Zabani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Psst, get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. Hurry it up. I get back before I missed. Come on. If someone missed... Me at the party, we're both dead. I need to lock the door behind you, or the patrols might notice something's wrong. Did Good you luck. see those robes You're marching on your own this now. morning? Who are they with? Four of the Emissary's treaty enforcers. No, they're high mages, just in from Alinor. I guess herself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. Ah, good. I've been wondering how we were supposed to defend this place from a dragon. If a dragon does... Maybe we'll get lucky, and it will eat the mages first. Might give us enough time to kill it. Ha! I'd like to see those arrogant bastards taken down and... Always looking down their noses at us lowly foot sloggers. <laughs> well, we'd better get back to our route. Never should have come. <laughs>
But I need that money. I earned it, huh? I have my own expenses. <laughs> Your life advanced and now forfeit. Huh. 
I told you. I don't know anything else about it. What? Who? What? Yeah. Come on. This way. I've seen the guards use it to get rid of bodies. It must lead... I damn well... They're after... I've seen a... Not much... That's it? Now, let's get out of here. <sighs> Whatever you want. But let's go. Now. Listen up, spy. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender immediately, or you both die. Never mind. Silence. Dead Never should have come here. That's it? That's your best? Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. You and me, we're the only people around who aren't complete fools. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. You made it out alive, at least. Your gear is safe in my room, as promised. Did you learn anything useful? Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about that. Esburn? He's alive? I thought the Thalmor must have got him years ago. <laughs> that crazy old man. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying to find out what's going on with the dragons. You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Esbern was one of the blade's this archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed us during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the blades. Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't as crazy as we all thought. 
We'll drive out the storm cloaks and restore what we are. Riften, eh? With our blood down Probably down in the rat way, then. It's where I'd go. Home. You'd better get to Riften. Talk to Brynjolf. Down He's well-connected. A good starting kings. point, at least. Oh, death, and when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, you may have some trouble getting him to trust you. Just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. You'll know what it means. The blades have always guarded and guided the Dragonborn, but we'd forgotten why. Now our purpose is clear. I'm all that's left of the blades, and you're the Dragonborn. Together, we're going to stop these dragons if we have to put every last one of them back in the ground. The Thalmor happened. They've been hunting down every blade they can find for the past 30 years. Thanks to the White Gold Concordat, they've been able to operate throughout the Empire with impunity. When I was young, our leaders became obsessed with the Thalmor threat. They believed that if and when we found a Dragonborn, we would need to protect him against the Thalmor. Turns out we fatally underestimated the Thalmor. They smashed us with ease during the Great War. I was one of the few who escaped. For a long time, all I cared about was staying alive and taking revenge on the Thalmor when I could. But then the dragons returned. And I remembered that the Blades used to be dragon slayers, and that we were sworn to protect the Dragonborn, the greatest dragon slayer of all. Hmm, there's no simple answer to that. You want the long version or the short version? They're the High Elves that ruled the Eldmeri Dominion. Thirty years ago, since then they've been working to weaken the Empire any way they can. What do you need, Dragonborn? This land is ours. We'll see it wiped clean of the scourge that has sullied our hopes and our dreams. <clears throat> oh, what happened? 